A little update here and some tweaking there to keep everything running smoothly. Last week we kicked live another update to add a load of content to the game. This consisted of all the trinkets for the football event and also to fix a pesky issue which caused your items not to be visible in your inventory. But now, if you want to see your items, you can easily. And if you want to pick up a trinket with a flag on it for your country if they qualified for something, then you can. Yesterday we pushed live another update to fix a couple of bugs to improve your experience in our menus and with contracts. So now you won't have extra notifications to click through when re-rolling contracts and items won't stay visible in your inventories after they've been recycled. We've also done a few back-end tweaks to the contract system to fix a couple of issues and make them a little quicker to complete. For the full details of these, check out our release notes on the official forums and Reddit and be sure to let us know what you think. Steam trading has been a long time coming. But the good news is we're finally able to fully test it. With this being the case, we're another step closer to getting this live for you to enjoy. We'll keep you up to date with any further progress, so be sure to keep an eye on our social channels. And if you want to start preparing now, join the trading sub on our forums to track down the items you want to get your hands on. Our football event is in full swing, and the national pride is flowing. For those of you not in the know, you can now pick up a selection of national flags for countries who have qualified for a currently active worldwide event. And the best thing? On days your country competes, you can get a sweet discount too. For those of you who don't have teams involved, we may add more flags in future, but so far nothing is concrete. Hi guys, I'm Radio, tech artist on Dirty Bomb. Please leave your questions below, but for now, let's get some answers. Are you planning to tweak Phantom again? You can see him quite well when high quality material is off. Thanks for letting us know. We'll take another look at Phantom to see how big of a difference it makes. We'll then treat it as a bug and triage alongside other work. Will there ever be a dual pistol or a dual SMG gun added to the game? We have no plans for this as it's a significant amount of extra animation work against single handed weapons. But I wouldn't rule it out entirely. Can you roughly estimate when Steam trading will go live? There's a lot of different moving parts, and sadly we can't provide an estimate right now, beyond as soon as possible. We're doing our best to get testing finalised and everything on our end ready as quickly as we can. Would there ever be a Linux version of the game? This would be a huge amount of development work, and we'd only see a player base increase of roughly 2%. So for now, we're going to continue making DB the best it can be on PC. The Inverted Wolf has been playing DB for a while, over 700 hours to be accurate, and in this video they show off the skills they've picked up. Last week you reported issues were contracts, trading and missing items. For contracts we've made some tweaks to the system and we'd love to hear what you think, so check them out in the official forums. For trading, we're in our final round of testing to make sure everything is working correctly and we'll kick it live as soon as we can. And for missing items, this issue has now been fixed. If your items still aren't showing up though, check your filters on the right hand side of the menu and make sure all is selected. Subscribe! And let us know in the comments which of the football trinkets you've picked up so far.